My name is Bryn Barlog. I'm a student at Lakota West High School, and I am a senior, and I am missing my dad. My life with my dad was very bright. It involved a lot of sports, and it was just so much love and support. A lot of emotions that I felt um, after my dad died were just scared of what the next steps were going to be like and what my future was going to look like without my dad. My biggest thing that I struggled with with my grief compared to then and now is definitely not going to people. I would keep it all bottled in because I didn't think anyone was there for me and I didn't think that I had people where now after Companions on a Journey has showed me that there are people here for me and opening up and my feelings are valid and it's okay to cry and it's okay to feel sad and it's okay to not be okay sometimes. When I first walked into my first group, I was very nervous. I was so scared, I was so shy, and I just like looked at everyone and I wasn't very open, where now I am so excited to go to um, Companions on a Journey. There's things that I think about that I'm like, I'm gonna talk about this or bring up that and just a realization of it's more, it's so welcoming there. So now I am currently at a tech school for my junior and senior year at Butler Tech for um, dental science. And Butler Tech does not currently have a Companions on a Journey group there. So I leave Butler Tech once a month to go to Lakota West to attend Companions on a Journey. And there are people at my school that I've realized and I can see that they need this group. And so I have contacted Sheila and I'm like, please come to my school. This group has affected me and helped me so much and I just want to help others at my school. I would say that Companions on a Journey definitely shows that you're not alone. There are so many people there to support you and it is definitely one of the best things that I've ever joined.